Hello friends and welcome to Tony's Reviews. A while back I did a review for a flagpole light and it was uh, one of those kind that uh, actually sits on top of the flagpole and shines down. Today I'm going to be reviewing a light for the flagpole that actually shines uh, from the bottom of the flagpole up. And this is the Oppo Nuo flagpole light. Today we're going to unbox this, take a quick look at it. I'm going to stick this on my flagpole and we're going to see how well this thing illuminates my flag out in my yard. And this Oppo Nuo flagpole light, just like the Vaught light that I reviewed, is also solar powered. And you can see right here, while it's still in the foam, you can see that big solar panel right there. I paid around $42 for this on Amazon, and there will be an Amazon link in the description and also in the comments of this video. So I think there are a few different ways you can actually use this if you want to. It does come with a couple of ground stakes. I'm not sure exactly how to use those. You can see here from looking at the instruction booklet that comes with it, that it... Uh, actually attaches to a flagpole like that, like at the base of a flagpole and then shines up. But I think you can pretty much, you know, install this however you want to as long as it works. So here's the solar panel and it's pretty good size and it feels like it's pretty good quality. Not that I know a whole lot about solar panels. And then we have the light there. It's got the LED diodes in there. You can't really see them too well, but it says it's 500 lumens. And you position this light so that it shines up on your flag comes with some gear so you can secure this to your flagpole. You can tell it's pretty simple to install. You're just going to be taking each piece of this and wrapping it around a flagpole and then securing it with the hardware. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to install this to my flagpole. We're going to let it sit out there all day in the sun and then we're going to test it out and see how bright this thing actually is and just see how well you know it lights up. It says this has two settings, it has low and it has bright. It says that in low setting it will last for 12 hours and in bright it will last for 6 hours. Of course I'm going to try to use this in bright. Uh, with that monster <laughs> solar panel right there, I would hope that you know it really charges the battery up. If you look at this online, this isn't really just a flagpole light. They advertise this as a light that you can use for pretty much anything. It comes with the ground spikes. Uh, it shows uh, somebody actually installing one of these on their roof and then using it, you know, to light up a walkway. So it's basically a solar light that's, you know, just conveniently made that you can put it on a flagpole. And uh, anyway, I think it's a cool marketing idea. So I've got my flagpole inside now and I'm going to install this light. You can see first though, uh, right there's the Vaunt solar powered flagpole light that's at the top of this uh, flagpole right now. If you want to check out the Vaunt solar flagpole light, you can just click on the link above right now. You can see right here, this flagpole is actually just a little bit too skinny for this mount. So what I've done is, is I've taken a couple of these little plastic pieces. These are the ends that you normally see on a set of uh, blinds. I didn't use these, and I've got some alien tape on the ends of these. You just click on the above link right now, and it'll take you to my alien tape review. This stuff's pretty good. All right, so I've got two pieces of plastic in here to work as wedges now. So you can see here, I've got the light out here now, hopefully charging. It is overcast today, so we'll let it charge and we'll see how much light we get on this thing tonight. Here you can see the light and it is shining very brightly on this flag. As a matter of fact, it's a lot brighter than the uh, Vaunt light, which is the one there at the top. I've actually got that one off right now. But you can see this is in its bright setting right now and it's very bright. So that looks really good. And it's, going to keep that flag lit up for a long time, I hope. This is what dim mode looks like. And here it is from the front. And that's dim mode right there from the front. And right there is bright mode from the front. That is really bright. As a matter of fact, I think that's as bright or if not brighter than some wired lights I've seen on flags before. So that looks great. Awesome. And for the last look on this, I've got the light we're reviewing right now there on the bottom. I've got it in dim mode and then the top light, the Vaunt light there, is shining as well. I just want you to be able to see what this would look like with both lights going at once. And now I'll put it in bright mode there on the bottom. All right, so now we got double light going on this in bright mode. So we got the Vaunt light there on top going, and then down here we've got the light we're reviewing in bright mode, and there's a lot of light on that flag now. Check it out. All right, it's, it's about seven o'clock in the morning, 
and the light is still going. This is in bright mode. So you can see that the light is still going on the flag. It's definitely not as bright as it was whenever uh, you know it first kicks on, but it did go all night. Just showing you that. So we had a chance to check out this Apo Nuho. I think that's how you pronounce it, flag light. And it turns out to be a pretty good light. I like how bright it is. We definitely want to be respectful of our flags. And I like the idea that I don't have to worry about turning the light on at night. So I am not disrespecting a flag or not following proper flag etiquette. Solar power makes it super low maintenance. And then also it's got the sensor in there. So it just automatically comes on when it gets dark outside. That is a win-win. And it seems to be working fine. So I'm really pleased with this light and I'm glad that I bought it. Paid around $42 for it on Amazon. There will be an Amazon link in the description and also one in the comments of this video for that Aponuo light and also for the Vaunt light that's at the top of the uh, flagpole there. And folks, if you enjoyed this review today, please hit the thumbs up. If you know somebody that might need a flagpole light, please share this video out. And if you'd like to see some more of my product reviews, please hit the subscribe button. I want to thank you so much for tuning in to tell me these reviews today and God bless you.